In this video, we're going to derive an expression for the equivalent stiffness of springs that are attached in parallel. The way that we're going to do this is that we're going to imagine that we're going to move the block in the x direction if we put a coordinate system here. This also tells you that it's a one degree of freedom approximation. So movement in the y direction is not permitted. And um, so what would be the force exerted on the block? Well, displacement for the first and second spring are equal. And the force would be minus k1 times delta 1 minus k2 delta 2. So essentially what that is is just the free body diagram of the spring. And this is F pulling force. And this is force by the first spring, second spring. OK, but since delta 1 is equal to delta 2 is equal to delta, then we can say that F minus, sorry, K1 plus K2 times displacement is equal to F block. Well, this looks uh, a lot like K equivalent times displacement. So the equivalent stiffness is equal to K1 plus K2. Um, if we would put more springs in parallel, then we can write a general form of this equation. It's the sum of all stiffnesses. And that's it. Now we did this um, theoretically. We could do it empirically by simply um, having an apparatus that allows us to put springs in parallel and measure the pulling force and find a link between that and uh, the, the, dis the displacement and the spring constants. But um, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.